let me skip this. God damn it. Heckin' annoying as heck, bro. So very heckin' annoying. Alright. What was I doing? I was leaving Luca. Correct. I was listening to his story. Were you listening to his story? Were you listening? Intently, perhaps? Also, I'm, I'm crunching on some seaweed, so if you hear crunching for the moment, that's why. Because seaweed is a great snack. It's very yummy. Okay. We are leaving Luca. Oh, we're going to get... Th oh, wait, wait, wait. I want to talk to the news person. Do you know anything about the fiends inside the stadium? We have a few facts. You can't write up a feature on it yet. Hey, congratulations. I got everything on Sphere. Never in my wildest dreams did I think the Besaid Orox would win the cup. Yeah, you're goddamn right. Because guess what? I'm fucking great, dude. What the hell did you think? Also, howdy, Ian. I hope you're doing well. Are you still dogma in your dragon? Is that still the fixation, if you will? Wait, do I have the shitty controller or do I have the good one? You think he's gonna stay here? Mm. Let me go plug in the other controller just in case. Because right. I think I have the bad one. Do you think he'll find a way back to Xanarkand? In any case, I'll miss having him around. He's still in town, isn't he? I think I'll go see him. Because we're only in cutscene hell right now, oh. so it doesn't matter. Whoa. Sororin. Also, I don't think it's going to happen. But, like, I might... <laughs> my power may go out, because apparently it's thunderstorming, I guess. Yuna. Waiting. Sir, I beat... I dogging me. Dogging my... Dragging my dogma. Uh, and there isn't... A new game option right now? No, no. Huh. We accept. You have no desire to new game plus? <laughs> Was it that much? But why? Had to do something so to say best of luck. Oh thank you, Michael. I appreciate that. Good luck with whatever you're doing. I might be here when you're done, or I might not, but we'll see. But I appreciate it all the same. Thank you. You're welcome to join us. He says howdy. This one, I promise. Game plus sucks in all games. Yeah, I can I could see that. It's just like it's for the people that can't stop playing a game and just want to keep playing, but definitely don't want to restart the grind all over again. Like you know, your Dark Souls, if you will. You can go in New Game Plus. Sure, some things might be tougher, but you're like kitted out for that. So like. What even the what even the fuck matters, right? Where are we headed? Hey, mm -hmm. come with me. Well, you know? <laughs> I take one step. Look at him. <laughs> He's so pouty. She learned so good. Hey, you got pretty good. Stop being so pouty, dude. Jesus. Yeah, maybe. Want a scream? Mm, I really don't think that's gonna help this time. Did you miss that? No, you didn't. You are just on time, Selkie. You are right on time. It's I can say goodbye to my characters. Yeah, I, I get that. It's not often that I get attached to characters in video games like that. I do sometimes, but then it's just kind of like, well, I'm just kind of playing the video game. The best scene in the game. Yeah, that's right, Chapa. Welcome, welcome. When I'm feeling sad. We're uh, about to laugh our goddamn asses off. I know it's hard. Like we can rag on it all day long. Yeah. Besides, whenever we can see Kimari's undies. <laughs> uh, we can rag on this scene all day long, but at the same time, like, it's 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 good. It's good character. 
because like they are they are pushing through especially considering yuna who knows her fate and cool rank here who is still blissfully unaware he is living in bliss of like, oh, we'll <laughs> defeat Sin, and Yuna's gonna come and come live with me, and we're gonna be ba have made babies, maybe, on, perhaps. One, one child, perhaps. Is there official artwork of Yuna in Titus's outfit? I feel like I've seen that. We thought this scene became a meme. It's actually a touching scene. Yeah, right? Like, it's it's easy to pull the meme from it, but like, it really does mean so much. You probably shouldn't laugh anymore. <laughs> I do hate seeing his teeth polygons in his mouth, though. It's a cute moment. It is a cute moment. Her warrior outfit in FF10 2. That might be what I'm thinking about. Yeah, I think I think that's what I'm thinking about. It's pretty cute. I want my journey to be full of laughter. Same stance, yeah. Okay. Then that's that's probably where my mind was with it. Um because, you know, I notoriously have the take that I dislike her um, gunslinger. Her, like, her base, her base look in 10-2, which is gunslinger. I'm not a huge fan, truthfully. I prefer this, you know. I prefer the gown. It's just, like, I just like the look of it more. Um, her Her super long ponytail confuses me, but, like, that just is what it is. What are you looking at? We were just worried you guys might have gone crazy. Sorry. Well then, all right. Now, we will go to the temple at Jose. And guardians. The Jose. Don't forget to smile. Love both FFX. Yeah, I like I like both of them too. Um. Once once I get through this one, I'll definitely play through Ten Two because I. For how many times I've played this one, I've played Ten Two maybe. <laughs> half the times I've played this game. Um, mostly just out of, like, you know, how my relationship with video games in general. Fortniting. Man, Soki, you on that Fortnite grind. Good on you. Alright. Chat for your level 2. Thanks to the achievements, you can now save and are now teleport to the Blitzball Stadium. Blitzball scout. Many denizens of Spira are avid Blitzball players. Press square to scout them. Sign the best players in Spira and lead the Oroks to victory. Mm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. I don't think we're going to be doing that, <laughs> Chief. I don't think so. I don't know about that one. Oh, God. My phone is in my pocket. There's no good notifications. I shouldn't be on my phone. Um, this this part of the game always really stood out to me, but I always like... Like, it stands out in my mind, but I always forget that this is immediately after us playing Blitzball. We walk up the hill, we walk up a staircase from a city, and then there's all of this. Like, <laughs> okay. I mean, like, you know, they built it. Selkie has some takes about the way they uh, they build in this in this world. Oh yeah, I have the shitty controller. Fuck, that's fine. Let's talk to this, this guy. Of Lord Mien. Eight centuries ago, he founded a legion known today as the Crusaders. In just a few short years after their founding, their ranks grew throughout. Yeah, you know, there's a sequel, a sequel game. novel to Tens. Uh, yeah. Mm -hmm. So Lord Meehan walked along this very road to go face the Just a, yeah. Just a ruined suburb. Yeah. It's... The the 10 content goes uh, way more 
is, is way more dense than uh, than you would think for being ten. Good luck beating Donna in an Aeon fight. Is that coming up? Do I do that here on the road? I thought that wasn't until I get to, like close to the to the Jose Temple. Because I have to just before getting Ixion. Oh yeah. It's also tough. Let me handle this. No way. I can take it. Ha! Uh, you know, you're pro you're probably right. You've this game is certainly fresher in your mind than it is in mine. So. Told you, Sir Arn's the best. <laughs> I could have done that. Not Donna, it's the other summoner. Oh, the one, the one, yeah, the one girl, where she's wearing like the the dress and the weird like head domes on either side. Yeah, okay. No, that is a yeah, yeah, yeah. That's a one v one Aeon fight. Okay, because you know I thought we did. We do take on Donna at some point. I'm pretty sure. City? Correct. A city most ancient. I like this scholar's voice. He sounds exactly like he looks. Princess Leia. <laughs> you're not wrong, actually. You're you're super not wrong about that. That's kind of. Hmm. I don't think she's as based though. Studying the history of our world, Spira, seeking its stories and secrets. My travels have taken me to many places, and I am troubled by what I have seen. Fragile smiles on people's faces, crumbling at the mere mention of sin. They are counting on you, milady. Give them a reason to rejoice. She is a force ghost. Yeah, I, I forgot about that until recently, because... In order to get... Is it in order to up get, to get the second upgrade for Yuna's weapon? Um, you have hey, to... Now, so watch out. Okay. You have to first get all of the Aeons. And then you have to beat her in one final fight. And then you get the other moon whatever thing to upgrade um yuna's ultimate weapon i think that's how it works not a not a hundred percent certain oh wait a minute never mind I'll, I'll i'll farm for spheres later i don't really think i need to do that well actually mm -hmm. don't remember if you actually ever battled donna but it's been a few years okay you played the remaster for ps3 that's where I started. Well, that, that was the last time I like, put my hands on it, but I only played like maybe five hours of the game. I think so. That's how you also get summoned with the sisters. Is that how you get that summon? Or do you get... Uh... Hmm. Do you get the summon? With... I, thought you how... I thought you had to get them all, including the sisters, Anima, and Yojimbo, and then beat her. I, I could be incorrect. I could be misremembering. It's very, very likely. Um, Go. Uh, yeah, okay. That's what I want. Never go for her weapon, but I think something like that. Yeah, her... her <laughs> oh. I think I'm just going to leave him dead. He kind of deserved that one. <laughs> Stupid fuck. Oh my god. You have to beat all her battles. Yeah. Because you get her every every couple. It's every once in a while she shows up. Where'd my ability sphere go? I, 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 uh, before you fight her with the sisters. Yeah. Okay. Right, 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 right. Okay. I follow. I follow. Fucking Waka. I am like brain freezing. Holy shit. That's fine. Let's go exploriating. Oh shit. Paying off. Let's go. 
I don't think Ice is really going to be... I don't think I'm going to be switching out of the Brotherhood really anytime soon. Oh my god, this fucking controller. Don't quite understand what people see in Waka other than he has character development. I mean, I don't see anything in him despite the character development he goes through. <laughs> Lucille, captain of the Jose Chocobo Knights. And I'm Alma. We've been charged to guard the Rule 34 is turning me around. No! Don't be so weak! He's shit! It doesn't matter if he can be sexy. He's, he's terrible. Don't give in. Thank you. Don't be weak! Good. We should get back to our Like... Okay, you have to beat her. In battles including three secret Aeons, then collect one of each monster in the Calm Lands for the monster arena. That, yeah, that's one, that's one half of it. Um, let's go get him. Cause doing that. It's the right thing to do. It's the right thing to do. Eh. I mean, if I if I get around to wanting to do that, then maybe. What I say now? He is shit, but dad bod. Said that I guess. Does he have a dad bod? Every time he said it. Is it just because he's older? I don't know. <laughs> also, the not lesbians. I ship those two women. <laughs> I mean, you know, that's fair. Oh, there she is. There's the, there's the girl. Let's see if Waka cannot completely eat shit. Wait, whose turn is next? Waka. Um, how do I want to do this? Because I need fucking... Make one enemy drop ability spheres, because I need ability spheres. 60, because if I swap in Titus, I'll be able to get that. Oh, that bod. Mm, 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 mm. I see, I see, I see, I see. Does the extract ability only work if her hit kills it? Or... Hmm... So he does have a dad bot in 10, according to Riku. Mm. Yeah, well, you know. No accounting for taste on, on Riku's part. She's just kind of the way that she is. No, you just have to hit it. If it misses, then it won't trigger. Oh. I wasn't paying enough attention in the last fight. If to see if it missed or not. Because I didn't get an ability spear. Um... In the in the previous fight, but again, I wasn't really paying attention. This character model looks like the same, just like Pregnant Lulu. Yeah, pretty much. Um, I mean, it doesn't matter. I can. There's. Oh, I forgot about the sub menu. Like over there. I totally forgot about this menu, because I never fucking use it. Can I just... I can't, like, just defend, because I don't... I am just swing. Fuck it. Oh, he hit him! Holy shit! I was expecting it not to hit. Pregnant Lulu is pretty cool, though. It's a good look for her. Okay, I got two ability spheres. Let's go. Maybe I should just farm for a little while. This, this road's a good place to farm. Oh, there's, um... What's her ass? Over there. Um, switching weapons of battle can be handy. It doesn't take a full turn. Yeah. It, it, it could be helpful if I have, like, a... You know, if there's a, a beast that is weak to ice and I have, like, the ice brand or some shit. You know what I'm saying? That could be quite useful. Um, oh, yeah. I skipped all these because I don't need them right now. Because I'm just trying to get... What's this one? Is this life? Yeah, that's life. That's life. Kira is here. Okay, that's yeah, that's the direction I want to go. Oh, forgetting that I can that you can go between a couple of them and then just get the adjacent ones. Yeah. It. I struggle with like just using up like two to four to five sphere things and then just moving on, or if I like want to stockpile a bunch. Because it gives you incentive to like make small moves to so just get little increments. Because if I go here, all I'm really going to get is this. What's this? Strength power. That's for power spheres. Um, 
Well, like Waka's, I can jump him. Um, probably to here. Okay. Yep. Cool rank. Oh yeah, Chapo. Um. Uh, Selkie and Ian have been naming various uh, various individuals, if you will, for for the playthrough here. And uh, so far, we have our boy here, who is cool rank, and then our Aeons, which I will show you the names uh, once I am done here. Give me just a moment. What's that? Give me provoke. Yeah, we'll do that. That's fine. Um, However, let's let's take a look at some let's take a look at some Aeons real quick. We got Nice Rack. And we got Pissburn. Oh howdy Venny, welcome in. Cool Rank's portrait looks so disturbing. What do you mean? He's just a smiling kinda of smiley guy. He's not as smiley as Waka. I think Waka's the most smiley. Yeah, Waka's got the big smile. No, actually, Venny. Pissburn was Selkie's brainchild. It made it made Ian quite proud, that's for certain. Okay, let's um let's go fight this lady and see if we win. Cause I don't really get anything for a l I don't like die if I lose. She's just like, haha, you suck. Uh you too are a summoner? My name is Belgamine. You are? My name is Yuna. Ah, the High Summoner's daughter. I've heard much of you. But you are still fresh on the road, are you not? Yes, I am. I might have a few things to teach you. Hmm? I can teach you. Let us see teach you. Here's a tissue. My Aeons or yours? A one-on-one -on -one match. Not to the death, of course. What do you... Let's go. I'll do my best. Let's go. Your aeons have been healed. Nice. I probably could have grinded up their overdrives before uh, before <laughs> going into this fight. Buns bring all the Aeons to the yard. <laughs> doesn't even let me. Doesn't let us have a piss burn on piss burn fight. Instantly be suspicious of anyone who challenges you. Not to the death, of course. Um, what does Sonic Wings even do? Delay a turn. Yeah, let's get a delay. In. Let's get a delay in. Bahamut will be bad dragon. <laughs> I mean, it kind of writes itself, right? He like kind of has to. Immune to sensors. What a dick. So he would be a weak to Blizzard, not water. Well, I guess he's not really weak. Net weak, isn't there? Let's see, an Aeon's attributes rise with those of its summoner. Thus, the Ifrit one summoner calls may different. Okay. Why does that matter? Because if it's because this Ifrit's strength and HP are both high, it will win in a straight fight. Try fighting using your Aeon shield and boost commits. Oh yeah, I can do that. It receives damage, boost accelerates overdrive gauge, but increases the amount of damage received. Shield is the best bet. You see, a powerful hit. If it alternates between this, if it alternates attack and meteor strike, meteor strike is coming. So defend with shield. Okay. Well, that's nice of them to tell me, and I totally forgot that I could do that. Of course, Selkie gets the name Shiva. Absolutely, one hundred percent. We're gonna enter. Well, because then I get. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. I want to free hit in real quick. Want to delay his turn? 
Oh, it doesn't. It doesn't. It doesn't do that. All right, fine. Mm. Shield door. This Ifrit design is sussy. This Ifrit design is great. Like, I love this Ifrit design. I did confuse his, like, furry haunches and crotch with, like, a skirt. Like a skirt sort of thing. Energy Ray. Nice rack is the perfect name. It it, it ended, ended up working very well. I, I will agree. Um... See, because, like, I use my fucking thing, and then it gets three attacks in, and that makes me that's so annoying. So, because now I lose. Oh, 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 clutch. And it sucks, because Veil 4, you can't cast magic on itself to heal it, like you can with Ifrit. If you cast fire on Ifrit, or ice on Shiva, it just fucking heals and wins, you know? Um... Let's see if I can get away with a shield. Am I gonna tank the hit? Also, does this fight end when I lose Nice Rack, or can I switch to? Oh, we're up. we're still up. We're still up. Blizzard, please win. <laughs> please. Let let's go. Oh my God. We sitting on the. F oh, let's go. Oh. Is it nice like the only Eon you can't you get another overdrive attack? I don't actually know, actually. I don't rem remember if you get another overdrive for nice rack. Not bad for one, so Oh my god. How did I win? That was nutty! I'm cracked! <laughs> you show promise. With more training, you could defeat Thank you. But I think you might defeat Sin before I am able to. I cannot. Huh? Or should I say, I was not able to. You mean... Farewell, Yuna. We'll meet again. Sus. Now does Pisprint... Pisprint, man! Nice Rack stays hurt. That's some bullshit. Well... Well, I think I'm less in danger of my power going out now. But I'm gonna go and save the game, regardless. And, oh, fuck. Punk. Whack. Because he can't kill anything. And, okay, he killed something in one hit, so that's cool. Yeah, cool, cool, fine, whatever. Fear. <laughs> yeah, this is a good place to farm. But I'm not going to farm on stream. We're here for the story, TM. Orion. So... Is it piercing the is piercing the passive ability that gets you to cut through tough enemies like that? I think that's what it is. Which is why like if I gave pier if I gave piercing on cool ranks weapon, then I don't think I'd have that much of an issue with uh tough enemies like that. Yeah, and Orin's weapon all just have it. Yeah, okay. It's it's so it's like, hey, use use him to take down the tough enemies. And it's like But Orin's like mid in the late game. Oh yeah. Energy Blast is Veil for second overdrive obtained at Besaid by first talking to the girl in the shop and then finding the village dog. Oh. Okay. Kamari can do it as well, he just doesn't have... Yeah. Like, I, that's what I also recall. Um, 
was Kimari also, yeah, his weapon also having piercing. But you, you are right, his strength just is not going to be comparable. Um, I was talking with Josh um, the other day about the game, and uh, he was telling me, a, oh, fuck, I... God, I hate fighting this thing. Um, um, hang on. Uh, what was I saying? I was talking with Josh, and he said, like, one actual, like, viable build for Kimari is to just send him down Riku's route, like, super early on, which which makes sense, absolutely. Um, you will hurt no one. So, it's an idea, but I'm also not using Kimari even remotely enough <laughs> for it to matter. Do I get anything if I lance at this guy? Does he have an ability? Let's find out. Fire Breath, let's go! I was correct. Mm. God, that shit hurts so bad, dude. Oh, fuck. I didn't mean to kick the stand there. Um, Let's dark attack him, see if I can... Yeah, get darkened, bitch. We're just gonna go ahead and... We're gonna game. Check this out. Check out this gaming. Gaming! <laughs> shit! It's, it's that input lag, you, you know? It's, you can't do much of that input lag. Ooh, uh, don't even worry about it. Don't even worry about it, cut. Um, deals fire damage. Well, fire damage isn't going to help me. We're going to hold on to that Ronso Rage real quick. Um, I'm going to just heal. Actually, we're going to extract ability on him. Oh, he has 107. Kill him, Yuna. Crit. <laughs> Let's go. You usually send Kamari down or Nawaka's route. Yeah, if you want more like DPS sort of deal. Um, but like, if you send, like say you send Kamari down Riku's route, which is uh, this way? Uh-uh. Shit, I don't know where she starts, because this is Fyra. That's the second stage of Lulu's. Because you can get Steel if you send Kimari. I think Riku might be up here at the top, actually. Uh, no, because this is Orin, I think. Yeah, full break, that's Orin. Uh, shit. Yeah, if I can figure out which way is Riku's route, because, like, like I said, I was talking to Josh, and he's like, yeah, just, if you send her down Riku's route, you get steel really early in the game, and then you just kind of bust it. <laughs> well, is the game where the Ronso are from, from? Yeah, this is where the Ronso are from. Um, you know, very cool guys, very swell fellas. You playing the default sphere grid? No, I'm playing the uh, expert sphere grid. Be my Albed potion healer. Just start near the middle. Yeah. Probably should just do that. Um. Uh, okay. Um. Yeah. Let me look around for a minute. And uh, speaking of, uh, speaking of the Ronso. So when I'm not playing this game, which you know, granted, I've been starting back on it very long. I also started directly right of his spot. I think. Let's see, directly right. So like if I go this way, this is his this is his lancet. If I go that scan over here is Oh, steel. Okay. Oh, I need a level 1 key sphere though, uh, which I don't think I have yet. Um oh, when do I get one? Yeah, it's behind the level 1 key sphere. Um and I don't think there's a way that is going to be worth the time to... Well, actually... Mm, no, I can get around I can get around it. If I go up to Titus's route here, and then I go up and around up to where he is, and I can go down to basically get around it. So that's something I could do. Um, so let me think about which way I need to go, because I need to start going up this way. 
This will get him... Yeah. I need to start going this way. Because if I go up, I can go this way, down. Yeah, because I'm not locked behind the key, the key sphere. That's fine. I can just do that. I mean, if I get a key sphere, I'll just go back and do it quickly anyway. So, whatever. Chocobo Eater can drop a level one. Okay. Well, let's see if I beat it. Let's let's see if I can beat the Chocobo Eater. I was I was wondering that, and I mean I'm gonna try. Don't get me wrong. Um, but uh, we'll see. Um, what was I saying? Oh, so when I'm not playing this game. I have also started playing Final Fantasy XIV again. I know, I know, I know, I know. But I started playing XIV again, and I do have Shadowbringers, so I was like, let me make me a Ronzo man. Let me just make me a, let me make me a nice Ronzo guy. So I did. Um, he's, they're not technically Ronzo. The, the way that the, 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 the subclasses, I guess you could say, are split up, there's like two different uh, tribes almost. I can't remember the name of the first one, but the one I went with is the Lost, and the Lost are, I think the the lore, quote unquote lore, described it as like descendant from the Ronzo. Um, so, and I gave him a horn, so he's basically a Ronzo. <laughs> Venny, <laughs> yeah, <laughs> thank you. Yeah, the hell, the. Helians, yeah, okay. So I didn't pick them. I went with the Lost because I wanted Aronso. And he's kinda hot. <laughs> They're just kinda hot. <laughs> I mean I don't have to tell you guys, you already know, but like So yeah, if I'm not playing this game, I'm probably playing 14 <laughs> again. I started over and I made him new and we're going we're going tank. He's a marauder right now, and I'm not sure which direction I want to take him. But I figure going tank, I'll have a much easier time getting into at least some fucking cues for like for like the dungeons and stuff. Get a loved one sphere when I beat the chocobo eater. I I oh my god. I really appreciate the faith that y'all no wait, hang on. Let's just kill these things first. Um I really appreciate the faith that you guys have in me defeating the chocobo eater. <laughs> Cause granted, I've 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 had decent luck so far, and I do just feel like that this version of the game has been easier, like across the board. Um, you beat Blitzball, you can beat anything. <laughs> hey, you know, I'll take that. I'll take that confidence. Just wondering really if you'd even play that, because you do seem to like Elder Scrolls games. Play, play what, Vanny? What do you mean? Play that, what, 14? Bruh, I've... Oh, yeah, no, I mean... I can't say I'm a veteran, because I've got one character who's like... Level 58. That I've had since A Realm Reborn. Because <laughs> that's how infrequently I, I play. Is like... I'll be on it. I'll be on that grind for like a, a month straight, and then I'll just kind of stop, you know. Uh, which like, it's just kind of how I am with video games, you know. Oh, okay, so I missed that one. That's why. Uh, fucking goddamn it! You wanna stop being so weak? Monster C has a turn. Let's kill you. Please die. Um, but yeah, it might be easier because your experience with the game. Maybe. It's not too bad with knowledge of how the fight goes. Yeah, like I I, I remember it. Um, is is mostly what it is. Cause like you know, it's not my first time playing this game. <laughs> Especially reasonable with a realm reborn. Yeah, that's what I thought. That's what I'm thinking. It's um, not too not too difficult to uh keep going with it. I just also like. You know, you gotta pay for it. And if I'm not playing for a couple months, I just, I stop paying for it, you know? 
but it is fun and my roommate really has been has been asking me to start playing it again with him um, so that's part why I, I got back into it but I also was just like I need more Ronso content because also like so what what spurred me to start playing this game was that I wanted that was that I was listening to the soundtrack and I'm like you know and then I was remembering when we did our the we did the hymn of the faith and um, uh, an arrangement of the Ronso theme called Heart of the People in the orchestra that I'm in, and I've just kind of been in that that mode. I've, I'm in that mode, you know. I got Ronso on. I got Ronso's on the brain. This ends now. Is this what it's like for the rest of you all the time? <laughs> Oh, I say it affectionately. I say that affectionately. It's weird because if you have expansions, you have to pay. Even if you aren't on the expansions content yet, they all then go all the way up to the second expansion for free. Yeah, I mean, I owned up to Shadowbring. I owned through Shadowbringers before um, they upped the trial. So I own. So like you know, I just didn't play that far into it. I'm in I'm in Heaven's Word on my my main character. Um I just decided to start new. So anyway. King Magnum is on my mind. <laughs> Ian, those pop up on my for you page. I don't I I see you post them in the, in the in the Discord, but I've already seen them. <laughs> <laughs> I see them as they come out. <laughs> oh, that's so funny. Didn't know I was in an orchestra. Yeah, I've been, I've been performing in an orchestra since. Oh my god, probably it's been probably like three years now. I think it. I think it's been about three years. Um, we kind of organize. You know, it's by season. So, like, because we have like a we usually have like a spring season and a fall season. So, two, four, yeah, about three years. The the um, this coming concert is going to be on my birthday because Johnny, he schedules the concerts um, for the orchestra. He's the booking manager, and he decided to book it on my birthday. Like. What a douchebag. Um, hmm. My next pawn in DD2 is going to be King Magnum. Please, bro. Please. <laughs> oh, what do I play? Um, I mean, truthfully, I play a lot of instruments. Um, and I auditioned for singing in the choir and for clarinet when I joined. But I chose to stay with the choir. I sing, I sing bass in the choir. That's what I primarily do. Um... I almost auditioned for an ocarina solo that was last season, um, and I've been asked to fill in on percussion a few times, so I, I do kind of a little bit of everything. Um, so, hey, my dad sings in an orchestra as choir as well. That's awesome! Yeah. I sing a debase. We do video game music. It's really fun. I'll do my best. Happy birthday, has some work. That's what I'm saying. And, and like, it's fucked up, right? Well. So the concert's on a Saturday. And my birthday never falls on a Saturday. I have worked my, I have worked on my birthday every year for probably the last 10 years. I've never had it off. And I don't take it off because like, fuck it. And this one time um, that I actually have it off by the, the schedule, by the grace of the schedule of my life. And Johnny's like, hey, we're going to take your whole day for doing something else. And I was like, thanks, bro. Oh, is this a little girl that will have a very large growth spurt in two years? Yeah, basically. That's basically it. How does licensing work in terms of performing video game music? Um, well, it's a little more lenient. I Like, there is still, like, like fees and, and licensing that we do have to pay for. Um, but, like, we are a nonprofit. Like we mostly the the orchestra itself makes its money through donations and stuff, and 
we don't purchase arrangements of songs. All of our pieces are arranged in house by members of the orchestra. So, like, we're not we're not basically buying arrangements from Nobuo Uematsu and just performing them. Um, so that's that's roughly my understanding of it. Um, I don't know fully. You know, I'm not I'm not part of the administration, so. I don't have a lot of insight into the licensing aspect, but my my limited understanding is that's how it kind of works. Is we don't have as many hoops to jump through because we make the arrangements of the pieces. Mm. Always impressed with people who can work work with music. No musical aptitude. Everyone's got musical aptitude. Everyone has it. You just gotta, you know, it's at varying levels. Oh, watch me watch me piss off this kid, guys. Check this out. I'm gonna piss off a kid. <laughs> oh, should I talk to him? Hey, that was my ball. Since <laughs> some tough shit, kid. I was gonna say because FF can be stingy. I guess so. Um, I haven't heard about any, um, any particular issues, truthfully, uh, with. With that, because the um, like we we, it was not, it was like two seasons ago we did a whole, a whole Final Fantasy VII suite and we did Final Fantasy X songs, a Final Fantasy VI medley, we did, like we had basically one season where it was all Final Fantasy music, and then we have an album coming out pretty soon, as well that is just Final Fantasy music, um. So, like, you know, from my limited, from what I've heard, it hasn't been too much of a headache to get it produced and to be able to to sell it and upload it and everything. Look, I work in video games. I have technical aptitudes, but music always just eluded me. I mean, you know, I'm kind of on the reverse end of that. Like, you know, I'm certainly not educated, that, that educated in music, very, very lightly. Um... Certainly not like Josh levels or anything. I'll show you what I can do. Oh shit. Um. But like, you know, I'd say I'd say I have a little more art aptitude than than the average normie, and they're all gonna fucking kill Titus. Of course they are. Um. But. Uh, yeah, it's just kind of one of those things. Never really, um, I could never, I never really learned to draw well, you know, that's not something I ever really got into doing when I was younger, and at this point, like, I've, I've tried several times to, like, kind of get myself to learn a little bit, but I also, at the same time, it's just one of those things where, you know, I, I don't really have the ability to, like... I haven't taught myself to learn well in that regard, if that makes sense. Um, oh shit. I should be able to kill it again with um, the fucking thing. That's fine though. Kimari can get self destroyed. Oh shit, you're right, he can. Um, am I gonna kill it with a blizzard? I should, because I don't want to get hit with self destruct. Okay, that's fine. Local NPR section plays a segment an hour a week just dedicated to video game music. Sometimes it's orchestra from schools performing music or online bands. That's awesome. That sounds really cool. I like that a lot. Um, hang on. Let's make sure that we all don't fucking completely eat shit here real quick. Let me finix down. Gotta plug those albums, though. Yeah, I mean... Maybe I'm in a slump. Uh, if, I mean... The concerts, we, we stream the concerts as well um, on Twitch, and there should be a lot of the pieces still available. The mixing's kind of off, because, like, you know, uh, the, the orchestra as a whole is just community-based. You know, everyone, it, there aren't really a lot of professional professionals, you know? Um, so, but if, if you want to look it up, it's called um, WMGSO. It's the Washington Metropolitan Gamer Symphony Orchestra. That is the full 
title of the organization. Um, and you can find YouTube, Instagram, Twitch, stuff like that. I hate these so much, I always just run. I usually would too, but like, I'm just kind of in it right now. Let's, I just want to, I ain't trying to, trying to get fucked, you know? I ain't trying to, yeah, self-destruct. <laughs> the, the best move for Kumari. <laughs> too bad Kumari can't learn that growth ability. Mmm, that'd be pretty good, wouldn't it? <laughs> Kamari, use growth. But here, Kamari, do you need help for growth? <laughs> also, are you working on developing affection points for any specific character? You develop affection points for characters in this game? What purpose does that serve? I didn't really know. I mean, the only one I would give a shit about is Yuna. Because <laughs> I, I love her. Um, I didn't know that was a thing. Zelda stuff in your show? Yep, we do Zelda. This season coming up, um, so our concert in May, we have a whole Star Fox suite. And then, like, like it's like a six movement six movement uh piece that's gonna be the bulk of the the concert um but it's all star fox uh we have metal gear baldur's gate um what else mario kart that's gonna be a lot of fun it's gonna be a lot of fun giving these a listen yeah give them a, give them a listen there are a few scenes that are affected i honestly didn't know that I, I had zero idea that that was a thing. I can't hit this thing again with anybody else. There's is there is there no way for me to just pass turn? I'm going. Oh, it's triangle. I'm so fucking stupid. Why is Kimari so today caked? <laughs> I mean, he's a he's a beast man. Got to have them. Got to have them. Thick thighs for all that jumping that he does. So, what do you have, Titus? Throw potions on characters, and it raises affection points. Oh, I had no idea. I didn't know that. I didn't know that at all. Um, that cool rank needs a little bit of, a little bit of something. Let's just get my potion. Be done with it. Star Fox. Yeah, we're doing Star Fox. Snake Eater? Uh, no. We're doing... We're doing The Best Is Yet To Come, is I think what the song is called. Let me actually look. Let me in. Um... Oh, we're also doing... Okay, so we're doing... I have the list right here. First character you talk to in group scenes will increase points. Okay. Uh, let's see. Something called Haunted. Oh, Haunted from Pikmin. Let's do the Fuka Fuka from Super Mario RPG. Ooh. We're doing Quiet and Falling from Celeste. That one sounds super pretty. Um, and then the whole Star Fox suite, which is a bunch. Um, Mario Kart. We're doing The Best is Yet to Come from Metal Gear Solid. And we're doing an arrangement of, of the power, um, which is just going to be us in the choir from uh, Baldur's Gate. It's going to be pretty lit. Okay, there's nothing here. You can also decrease points by having Titus having Titus attack them in battle. Okay. I mean, that's cool to know. I, I genuinely had no idea. Let me see if I can get some ability spheres off these dudes. Because there's just... Alright. Okay. Okay. Get Kimari to kill you. Ru -ru 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 -ru. Bop some cool rank. Um, we're just gonna go ahead and cheer because I want to like get ability series of all these dudes if I can. Love the Star Fox soundtracks. Yeah, 
It's pretty cool. The pieces all sound really good so far. I'm excited. It doesn't mean go again, dude. I, I wasted your turn so we could get to Yuna. Thank you. Jesus. Just don't miss. Thank you. Dog on dog violence. Kimari's not a dog. <laughs> God damn it. Okay, sick. Give it a bonk, and uh, we're on our way. Give me all the mobility. Let me see all the mobility spheres. Ooh, yeah. Look at all the mobility spheres. Ooh, yeah. Give me Kamara. Look like a dragoon in 14. Yeah. I accidentally made my Ronzo look a little like Kimari in his color scheme, so I'm thinking about changing him. So, like with Titus's last overdrive, the one at the highest affection points will be the one to throw a blitz ball to Titus. Oh, yeah. Okay. I've only ever. <laughs> I mean, like, by default, I genuinely just thought it was Yuna, because I've only ever seen it with with her tossing the uh, tossing the thing. It feel it would feel so weird if it was Lulu, right? Like, that doesn't that doesn't compute to me. <laughs> Guess technically, Blue Mage though that class is special in fourteen. Yeah, it sucks. I like Blue Mage in fourteen. But it's kind of just dog ass. <laughs> it's not a real class. It's just a shame. But like, you know, how do you make that a real class when the point of a blue mage is learning the abilities, right? Like, learning the enemy abilities, it just doesn't quite... just doesn't quite work that way. Um, but, you know. Lulu was your default. Was the highest affection points for me? That is nuts. That's crazy. Just doesn't seem right. It's also really cute when, when it's Yuna who just tosses it. God, I fucking hate this dude. <laughs> I hate him. <laughs> he sucks. Let me just pop you in here and dark attack you real quick, because you're a pain in the ass. Just don't use fire breath and don't, just don't cheat and use fire breath. Um, get cool rank. Bonk you out of here. Shit, I didn't see if homie was weak to any magic. No, he's not. That's fine. We'll get Orin in here real quick. Fortunately, there's not a build system in 14 of the Blue Mage. It's only only the class that works like that. Yeah, it's a gimmick class. Like, it wasn't added for like real gameplay. It was just added for for fun, you know. Which I get it. Bring Kamari in just to be healed by Titus. <laughs> the scene in the ice area later, where the they drive the snowmobile is affected. The person with the highest points that isn't Walker or Yuna. Talk to Titus on the way to sh Oh, like the one that rides on the, the thing with Titus? That's a, that's affected too? For me, that's every single time without fail. It has been Yuna. Or not Yuna. Fuck. Um, Riku that's done that. That's been on the, the thing with me. That's crazy, man. Shit's wild. Wait. Um, let me just get rid of this shit. Come on, jump. Might as well jump. That was so weak. Oh shit, dude. Kamari, be, do better, please. Well, he's here giving dark attack, so like he's he's putting in the work. I can't really be mad. Uh, bonk. And Kamari actually has like a reasonable amount of MP instead of Oh shit, he's not darked. That sucks. Kill. Yeah, let's go. Post the page in Josh's server. Okay. 
I'll take a look at that. Because that is cool. Like, that's genuinely just not an aspect of this game that I had ever considered. Period. Um, what's this? No, we don't need that. Let's just extract power. Let's get here, get his hooks up real quick. Do, 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 do. So that's going up into Titus's. Am I out of strength spheres? Oh, no, wait. That was the only. I don't have one that's near here. I'm dumb. I can move two. I'll wait till I get to three to get to guard. That's fine. No, I don't want to. I want to upgrade some cool rank. Come on, cool rank. Show me what you got. Yeah, delay attack. Let's go. We want that. For me, Lulu rode with Titus on the snowmobile chat with him. Maybe you just really, like... <laughs> you just really did right by Lulu. Trying to steal her out from, from Waka, who doesn't deserve her. Um... Da, 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 da. Okay. Waka's got some movement. What's that? Aim. My last place who I intentionally made Kimari my beloved. Reasonable. Reasonable. Nah. Where we were here. We can get life, baby. Because. Actually, hang on. Let me move here. Because going this way gets me to Black Mage level 2 spells. Which, like, I might just. Want, I'm going to dip over here first. What is this? This is Reflect. I think I'm going to fill this out till I get to Reflect. And then I'm going to backtrack over here so that I can pick up these level 2s. Because then, Lulu will be completely obsolete. <laughs> and who needs her? <laughs> I could just have Yuna. Because her magic stat is just, just better <laughs> than Lulu's. Like, across the board. It's just, it's just better. There's Prey. In that one, Lulu, I think, rides with Riku and Kimari. Just rides the snow. Just slide top to Titus. No, Titus is holding. Yeah, okay. Yeah, that makes sense. Okay. And let me give a Potoin to Yuna. Okay. This controller is going to drive me insane. 2,000 gil. Let's go. We actually have money in this game now. That's pretty cool. Damn. That sucks. Sorry, maybe next time. No. You get your turn move, chump. Then we're going to dark attack you. Because you're annoying as hell. Get fucked. Get darked. Get darked, idiot. Power break. Unless he uses fucking fire breath, which would suck. What? He's darkened. Why did Gore hit? Yo, this is stupid. <laughs> what the fuck? How about we don't? Sorry, Kamari. <laughs> See ya, buddy. Oops. But now Yuna has Prey. Oh wait, I can only use that in battle. Which is fine. You know, whatever. That's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Yo, quit! Go away, bro. Let me take you out first. Thank God. Thank God. 
These two guys follow me, they say, we want some more. Get back. Um, I think Waka might be the better choice. He just has, I think he just has better damage output than, uh, uh, yeah, like barely any better. It's not like anything crazy. Look at that crit. That was pretty good. That went pretty well, I think. I have to say, pretty well. Fire Blade and Pearl Armlet. I've been getting a lot of drops. Let me take a look. Let's see, we got the Metal Bracer. And we got two Seekers Bracers, which is just HP. I'm going to keep the Metal. And this, we have that. And Fire Strike. That's not really going to help me right now, though. Light Shield is all he's got. Got Bright. Dark Ward. Dark Ward with more stuff. And Confuse Ward. I'm gonna put that on now because homie just keeps hitting me with that shit and it's really annoying. Pearl. Yeah, we'll keep this on for now. And then she has the Echo Ring, which is same, but has Silence Ward. Which is quite good. For a Magic Caster, that is quite good. Alright. Oh, I think we run into the boys over here. I think they got... Yeah! The boys! Uh, I already got the special. I don't think we need to do this. I'll be right back. I don't think we need that. I think we're good. I'm really glad this isn't one of those games that makes you drop money for running away. Okay, manageable. And we're all already here. The gang's already here. Alright, that's fine. Gang's already here. The not gay boys? I ship them as well. Farewell. Yeah, I, I can see that, but like, the the smaller guy is definitely like the young, the young one. Don't think you drop money for anyone. Yeah, this game isn't one of the... There's other Final Fantasies. I think in 6... If you run from a fight, you drop money. Like, a random amount. It's never crazy, but, like, it's just annoying. What up, fellas? Hey, we saw the game. You guys were great. Congratulations, Waka. Yeah, we did so good. We hey, won. Stop loafing around. Uh, uh, the Lady Summoner and her guardians... This mission requires our full attention. We've no time to waste. It's like, quit slacking off. Yes, ma'am. Apologies, ma'am. Carry on. See, keep your head down, say sir a lot, and you'll do fine. Right, sir. <laughs> hey, Yuna. Even though Yevon rejected us, we still believe in you. That won't ever change. Thank you, Sir Luzu, Sir Gada. It's too bad neither made an appearance in 10 2. You know, Should have just chosen a cannon. <laughs> As two of them, which one of them live and which one dies? I mean, there is a cannon. Luzu, di Luzu dies during Operation Meehan. The the red haired guy he dies during he he dies during Operation Meehan um, at uh, Mushroom Rock because like there's the point after the battle when like you see all the people like walking around those are the ghosts and you see his ghost walking around and then Gata's like shell shocked and like you know having having a a crisis which I would say is probably reasonable you can choose what man. I really don't know shit about this game. Because <laughs> every single time I've ever played, Luzu has always been the one to die. 
every time. That's crazy. It's always been the older put together one for me, yeah. What determines that? Responding to a text, give me a moment. You can go Gata into disobeying Luzu, and he will go into the fight and die. Oh! Oh, shit! Is there anything over here? And oh, this is where the boys were. I had no idea. That's crazy. to where Gato will live. Ah. I don't even remember that decision. Like, whatever conversation they have, I don't remember that at all. Hmm. Oh, we get to go see, like, little sister um, summoner. This, this, this girl, yeah, she's cute. We'll defeat Sin any way we can. But Yevon's teachings say... Enough. I don't think she's a summer. She might be just a scholar. I don't remember. Are you all right? <gasps> Lady Summoner? Yes, I am Yuna. It is an honor, my lady. My name is Shalinda. I am a Shalinda. What was all that about? It's Shalinda. You mean the one Gata and Luzu Low ranking about? sister. Okay, yeah. I kind of confused her with Ghost Lady initially. I thought it was like the young spunky girl who wanted to be a summoner that was like, Fight me, please! I thought she was our Wally, you know. A la Pokemon. That's bad, yeah? Let them use whatever they want. They still won't defeat Sin. But it's not about defeating Sin. The teachings of Yevon must be upheld. <laughs> I can't remember names for yeah, shit. That's okay. Right. That's fine. He doesn't matter because he's probably going to be the one to die anyway. He's probably going to die. Well, he's going to die. But I don't think... Don't say that. I mean, if I follow my instincts, Gata probably won't die because he never has for me before. Never seen that. Still, I can't put myself down every time I fail. People are depending on me. They're depending on both of us. Yes. Yes, you're right, my lady. Absolutely right. <laughs> Thank you so much, Lady Yuna. Now, I feel I have the courage to finish my training. Oh, Ian. Ian, we finally did it. We, fi we finally made it out of Murdoch's round. <laughs> Finally, <laughs> it took so long, dude. I won't go so easy on you next time. Oh my god. Uh, I mean, it was good when it picked up there at the end. We finally fucking made it. <laughs> Can't use forbidden weapons to kill the monster that is killing everyone. You have to pray and hope it goes away one day, right? You have to use magic. We don't. We we are anti-science in this world. No science. Um, let me do my sphere grid because I'm gonna have to fight the chocobo eater pretty soon after this next part. Who? M Murdoch's route in in the Smokorumu. 
we, we finished, we finally finished uh, Murdoch's route. What, what there is of it. It it took us forever, but we finally done. Well, maybe we will. Maybe we already started it. I don't know. How goes the dancing as people die going? Um, pretty good. We're just kind of we're at, we're at mostly the end of the road here, <laughs> which took fucking forever to get through. Um, but it's fine. You know, the grinding is really good here. Um. If I was here and I was ending stream, I would probably take a day to just grind on this road for a while, but we'll probably be fine, I think. Oh, no, you mean who's Murdoch? Oh, the the fox. The fox one. Smoke room only... Oh, you're right. I'm sorry. I must be thinking of something else. You're, you're right. Smoke room only has two routes. My mistake. You're, you're so right. Always watch the Murdoch's videos in chunks. I'm so tired of them. <laughs> <laughs> Who are you telling, man? <laughs> like, no hate. Like, genuinely no hate. The writers did a good job. They really did. But like, god damn, I am tired of that, man. <laughs> oh, shit. Let's see, let's go here. This is do do. He just has that power to insert himself in others' routes. He really does. He's that bad. I mean like you know, feelings vary. Like, Josh has his feelings about him, mostly for the memes, um, just because it's funny, and, like, I kind of agree with him, but he does have the problem of just, like, hey, my route now, it's like, nobody asked you to be here, dude. <laughs> Literally nobody asked here. Chap just getting indoctrinated into the world of Echo. Yep, we're not, not, not going to say anything else. That's all right. We rest here. Like Leo, no, Leo's different. Leo can show up wherever he fucking wants. Is that a problem? Oh, you just finished Leo's route? Let's go. Did you do both endings or just the good one? Where were her guardians? Murdoch is just sort of there. Like I don't dislike him. He's just there. That's probably the healthiest way to think about his. Think about him. Well. You did both? Hell yeah, you did both. That's the way to do it. Absolutely. Absolutely. It's just so funny. The it's bad like one. Sleep. What do you mean? That's the true ending. <laughs> okay. Did a lot on that road. Let's go ahead. Oh, no, no, no. I don't want to overwrite. Oh, shit. Why'd I do that? I literally said I didn't want to. The good one's horrific, too. We started Carl's route. Exciting. Is there a Al Bed book in here? Is there a primer in here somewhere that I'm just not able to see? Oh, there's a ground sphere. Use previously saved Albed Primer data to synthesize a new Albed Primer. Oh, they still have them. Oh. Okay. I mean, that's cool. I didn't see it in the first area. I usually find the one in the first area before I find it here. Um, But you'd think there would be an Albed Primer in here. Oh, what you got? What's your, what's your weapons? What you got for me? Isn't it so romantic? He patches up your deadly wounds with such care. Kudzu does it with Chase. K Kudzu is too good for him, but he is the main character. You kind of just have to take that for what it is. Chunter just the main character. We have no say in the matter. And he, and he gets treated like it, which you know what? That's fine. He is, like genuinely, he is just 
very compellingly written. Like, that is just... Like, Chunter's kind of cool, right? Like, sure, it's like, wow, how dare you be what you are, but also, like, it's pretty good. <laughs> uh, none of this is sword, and I don't feel like sifting through. I don't, I'm, I'm good for money. Yeah, we, we, we chilling. We big chilling. We big chilling. What do you want, Lulu? This might be the last time we can rest like this. All right. I've heard that the proprietor... Shalinda. But I was very relieved to find that he keeps... Okay. Kudzu kind of settles. He also has a waterbed, which shows personality. Yeah, that's that's the one drawback of that otherwise perfect man. Howdy, Cirrus. Welcome, welcome. That sunset was different from the Just one in the bathroom, looking at myself in the mirror. I, sh I should shave. Quiet. Almost. What if? Gentle. Chunter goatee. Yeah, it does feel like a really twenty-one-year-old without acting like a teenager. Yeah, for real. What you up to? Mm. So I'm going to unlock some lore for you guys. Some personal lore. I did in high school. Because I did grow enough facial hair in high school. Pretty. I didn't have the chunter goatee. Sure is. I didn't have just the chin. I had the hole around the mouth goatee. I had that one. But, you know, goatee's still a goatee. I know. I guess that technically goes by a different name. We've looked it up. I don't care. People just call that a goatee. However, I did have that in high school. Um, I made questionable choices in high school. But people liked it, you know, for the most part. I, I, I got compliments on it, I guess. People said I looked like a Spanish prince. Which is, you know, whatever. The person who, who would tell me that regularly, I think, liked me. Which is probably why, but... Such is the way. It's fine. It's fine. Well, I like this moment in the game. I like I like just sitting and talking with the girl. I love her. I love her so much. How do we do that? The devil look. Yeah, the devil look, basically. What did we do that was See, you are Spanish, right? See, there, you're perfectly fine. Absolutely. Was it using lots of machina or something? Oh, wait. Was that such a bad thing, really? Did I get any more summons? No, I haven't. We're currently on our way to the Jose Temple to get Ixion, which is the horse. Um, we still just have nice rack and piss burn. So, if I end up going in, you know, and you're not around, I gotta gotta save it. I gotta save it, man. Well, then we're the same. Though, like, you've had your run of these previous two. If we end up getting there tonight, that'd be cool. Um, like given it time it is, I might I might stream for another maybe hour, half hour. Um, I doubt we're gonna get there tonight. Um, but every you know, it, it is it is decided that you will get to name uh, Shiva, of course, obviously. Um, but we'll see we'll see we'll see who's around when I get to. Uh, when I get to Ixion, and we'll see what 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 the name ends up being of the anti-indoctrination messaging in this game. Yeah, I mean, moral, religion, stupid and bad. <laughs> what do we? I don't know. What do we call Ixion? You can't think that's a cute girl in the fifth seat from the right, and you can't be thinking about where you're going to go on that date because the minute you do, that's when you lose. You see, uh, Yuna, what I mean is, you really shouldn't worry, you know? After we beat Sin, that's when you can worry about the future. I guess. But Yuna, how are you supposed to beat something big like that? The final summoning. <laughs> Titus, you kiss men. Stop lying. <laughs> You're a men kisser. Don't kid yourself. With it, we can call the final aeon. That's the goal of the pilgrimage. The faith of the final summoning lies waiting in the far north to greet summoners that complete their pilgrimage. At the world's edge in Xanarkand. In Xanarkand? <laughs> she means the ruins of a city destroyed a thousand years ago. Thanks for eavesdropping, Oren. Yeah, 
you and Ian decided Bahamut is Bad Dragon. Yeah, he, he said that earlier. I think you were busy in the Fortnite sauce, but yeah. He did mention that it's going to be Bad Dragon, and it will be. It will be. I'm sure he's fantasized about Orin at least once. At least once, right? I mean, look at that man. Just look at him. You will go with us to if you look past how much he looks like Johnny Depp, then it's great. I'll go to Xanarkin to see it with my own eyes. I knew it couldn't be my Xanarkin, but... I had to make sure. There's some good Kimari slash Orin. Orin doesn't do anything for you, Selkie. Really? Not a, not anything. Are you not into? Are you are you not like? Do you not like like older like that? Is that not your thing? I don't know. I don't know. All right, let's save. So. So do we, um, do we like try to fight the Chocobo Eater? And if we lose the fight, do we start over? Do we reload and try again? Um, You're a guardian, right? I think this will help. Oh, shit, he just gives me a level one. How to use it. There's no special instructions for it. It's just... Let's go! Easy! I mean, I can't get to it yet, but like... That fucking works. Shit. Wait, what is this? Scan? Uh, mmm... Now I'll wait till I have more more spheres so I can leave the menu, please. <laughs> oh my god, I'm so stupid. Um, reload that bitch. Yeah, okay, okay. Well, if I if I lose the fight, if I get knocked off the cliff, I'll re I'll reload it. Plug my streams more. I mean, I guess like you know, streaming it helps me to just play so. games. A little bit more Sorry? just uh, helps keep me on it and I I, I'm me, I've been more I at a point of I am enjoying playing games oh, more like with people which is completely the opposite of how I used I to be really like for me games were like just a solo experience huh? um, it but it is fun to just chill out and just like talk and ah, shit and well, play a video uh, game you know helly do sad we he said mm -hmm. If you are interested, primers can be you gonna hook me up with a primer, brother? I figured there was gonna be one here. A whole bunch of fuck ton of books in El bed. Let's go. How's Kimari doing? Is he good enough to use? I mean, like, no, but he is, like, there. <laughs> oh, thank you, Salki. I'm trying, you know. I do want to finish this game though, because it's just fun, just very, very fun. No game to beat this year challenge. No, I have not, have not made a challenge of it. Not doing it. No stakes. We all good. I'm doing this for recreation. One of the things that made me love playing Elden Ring was that I streamed the whole thing with friends. Yeah, I was playing Elden Ring on my own, um, like solo, and for that, I think it works a little better for me. Because, like, I don't know if I've really played anything on stream for you guys to see that I, like, get I get tilted. Like, <laughs> Elden Ring, I get fucking tilted, bro. I get so mad. <laughs> My hetero gamer rage really comes out. <laughs> um, same with Mario Kart, especially if I'm playing with people. I get fucking tilted, bro. 
Uh, Kamari is always good enough to use. <laughs> True. If you beat Realm Reborn within the year, I'd be surprised. Yeah, like, I mean, yeah, I don't really have a good gauge for where I'm at in it, really. Um, I hit like a major story beat pretty recently with it. I'm in like level 20 some. I'm like early 20s with that character now, so like, I think I'm like level, I'm on like the level 15, 16 story quest. I had the pretty cinematic and everything. Yeah, first Souls game, so I had no idea about the mechanics. Yeah, fair enough. I mean, it's probably the most beginner-friendly, truthfully. I mean, people people say that, and I, I genuinely believe that. Um, oh, we should play Mario Kart? We should play Mario Kart, Selkie. That would be a lot of fun. Um, I've been brushing up. My account on my Switch doesn't have, like, the shit that I like to use. Um... Like the carts and stuff like that. I think Johnny's account on my Switch has the most unlocked. Um, well, that didn't work. Then. That didn't fucking work. Now did it? Um, what the fuck was I gonna say? I'm, I'm like getting all fucking mixed up and shit. All right, hang on. Bring out Yuna. Oh, he's weak to fire. Okay. Wait, what did that say? Vulnerable to darkness. That would have been fucking nice to know. Um. Let's get Kimari to dark attack. Give him some darkness. Deep in the darkest darkness. Um, no, Mario Kart would be a lot of fun, actually. Uh, I'm just trying to unlock the the carts that I the cart that I like to use. I don't even care. I'm just there to have fun and play. Yeah, I mean, I'm there to have fun and play too. I I just get tilted as fuck. <laughs> Holy fuck! Jesus Christ! Um, Double Dash will never be topped, that's true. You had the Wii U version? No. Uh, well, get the Switch version, dude! Like, seriously! It's like cheap! Eto. No, I don't have Protect. I was really. I was decent. Well, no, I wasn't close to it. I was getting toward that end of the um, the sphere grid for Yuna, um, and also you know I don't think anyone has poison touch on a weapon. I don't think anyone has one right now. Um, who's who's about to swap in? Um, well, let me get some damage on this bitch real quick. Bonk. Um, let me swap Kimari with Yuna. We're going to cast a Laifu on Cool Rank. Does my William voice come out? Not really. My William. Oh shit. My William voice is an intentional choice. Um, I do have to like change it. It doing William's voice for a prolonged period of time really fucking hurts my throat. <laughs> I don't think he's vulnerable to sleep. He's probably not. He's vulnerable to darkness, though, and I need that to fucking stay working. Let me see if I can bonk him back. Hey, hey, bro. Hey, bro. Hit this time, please. Let's go. Gaming. We are so gaming. Get fucked. Strike now. Hard and fast. Okay. Hard. <laughs> you hear that, fellas? We gotta strike now, hard and fast. Look at him. He's primed to <laughs> to be struck hard and fast. Yeah, Titus got delay attack, he do. Um, it didn't work on him though, uh, when I first uh, used it at the start of the fight. Um, okay, the Mario Kart, online Mario Kart is out for blood. Yeah, the meta for online Mario Kart is is truthfully just not worth the time like to try to to try to perform that's why i just prefer to play with friends because it's just bullshit he's probably gonna get back up oh thank god he's not um let me delay attack bonk let's see 
Your William voice will make Sam's voice throw day too. <laughs> Spread eagle. Let's get him. Look at that little look at that little guy. Helpless. Um um, he's weak to fire, so I'm gonna just try to blast him with some fire. Can I knock him back? With with like, cause my attacks after doing enough damage should knock him further back, right? Okay, it's not like a okay, it's like a weird we slide. <laughs> it's not actually anything that matters. Um. Let's guard. Because both these guys are weak as fuck. And he missed. What a fucking bitch. Let's go. Um, fire. I need to, like, put haste on someone. Because Orin's out here. I want to at least get him a few more turns. Well, now he's going to do the thing and push us back. Um, I need someone to have, like, fucking their limit break, please. You know what? I would love that exact thing that I just said. Lulu, 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 fire. Come on, just do enough damage to knock him down. I don't want to fall off this cliff, bro. Thank God. A no, delay attack won't really get me anywhere. Um, I think Waka would hit him harder than Titus, right? Am I incorrect? Wait a minute. Lightning strike. Ooh, he has a fireball. Does still mana? Oh, let's go. Fire. Okay. That's... That's way better. Come on. Let us slide. Okay, cool. We good. We sliding. We slipping and we sliding, bro. Um, guard. Because if it attacks Lulu, she's dead. Okay, that's fine. We're at, we still out here. I, don't even, I, ain't, I ain't even worried, beach. Who the fuck? Who the fuck you think you are? I am. Um... Dark attack or get him some darkness. He's gonna push us again. It almost looked like Waka was just gonna go for the ride. Like he I thought he was do toast. Alright. Get him a little more damage. <laughs> Come on. Why did it do so little? What the fuck? Oh, I really hope he doesn't fucking... I don't have a turn to spare. If I summon an Aeon, can he push me off? Like, if I summon Nice Rack... How much health does he have left? I can't tell with you. How much health does he have left? 47... I can get away with summoning Nice Rack, can't I? Yeah, let's go. Ow. He does have so much HP, Cirrus. I mean, like... I mean, we can lose this fight if he kills us, but truthfully, he, he likely won't kill us. Because, like, the, the thing about this fight is you're more than likely to get pushed off this cliff. Um, which doesn't kill you, it just makes you take another road, and you don't get to travel with the chocobos. Let's delay its turn. Let's go. Come on. Did it work? It can cast magic from the ground? That's stupid as fuck. Alright, that's fine. Because I think this will knock him back. It has to. It's going to deal enough damage. We're going to have to get a little bit of knockback from this. 
right? It has to. Okay, we're fine. Hello. How are you? Good. How are we still alive, bro? What? We're still up. You don't think you've ever been pushed off the cliff? Yeah, the first few times I ever played this game, I got pushed off the cliff because I just was more worried about keeping the characters alive than anything else. Okay, nice rack. I just need you to dodge one more time and then we are clean. Dodge, dodge it. Fuck. That's fine. I think we were away from the cliff. Um, it's Lulu's turn. I mean, she's not going to kill this turn, but I should be able to win. Yeah, let's. We haven't had. We haven't really had him in a fight yet. Let's go. Get to watch the summon animation. It's always fun. I do like this one. This one's good. Get to ride on his little shoulder. Ah, so good. This is such a good Ifrit design, man. I really like this one. Let's go. I'm cracked. That one hurt. And he jumps right back up. That is that is that is garbage. Oh, I'm not taking any chances. We're gonna just fire his ass. Get shit on, dude. Get shit on. Let's go. Oh my god. I wasn't worried. <laughs> Barely got anything for anybody in that fight. We're gaming, dude. And now we get to ride the chocobos. Which is awesome. Have you an interest in renting some chocobo? As a token of our gratitude. Ren's slutty little collar? What the hell? Please ask the attendant if you It's a ring there for grabbing and pulling. Thank you so much for saving the chocobos. So, I could ride the chocobo. Look at, him, look at him float. So I could ride the chocobo. Or I could walk. Do you still get in fights if you ride the chocobo? Hmm, no fights. It just gets you through the road faster. I know that. So, like, I mean, it's cool, enjoyable, but, like, I don't think I want to pass up on the experience for it. Also, let's get Kamari through this fucking level one uh, sphere real quick. Let me use this level one key sphere, get him through here. So we can start stealing stuff and getting cracked. Right from the fucking jump. Extractability, also helpful for more ability spheres. We love that. Let's see, there's an item to get on the way there. With the chocobo jumps? Oh. I guess that's why you would do it, huh? Okay. Um, I think I have to talk to this girl. No charge this time. Nice. I want to know the controls. <laughs> I can move around. I can press circle to dismount. Chocobos can be ridden along the Mian High Road. You cannot enter Luka or pass beyond the High Road while riding a chocobo. Chocobo will wait for you where you leave it unless you leave the Mian High Road on foot or you rent another chocobo. Okay. Wait, so can I rent one now? I have to talk to you? No. Oh, let me ride. Let's ride. Oh, 
Hi, Derek Hose Corner 2013. How are you? Welcome in. I just got a chocobo. Hmm. Scenic. It looks like a cruise ship in the middle of a bridge. Like. Eh. Also, the chocobo theme for this game, pretty good. The controlling the chocobos, a little jank. But, you know. We do the best we can. Yeah, well, no, the con the chocobos aren't controlling Jink. It's my just, just my controller. Cause like there's that treasure chest, but I can only get to those if I fell down the cliff. Cause there's a whole other road down there. I remember the first time I like got to do this, I was so hyped. Cause <laughs> it was like probably the fifth time I played through this game, and I had never once beaten the um. Oh wait, is that? What are you doing, bro? Oh, are you jumping? Yeah! That's how you do it. The Hitoranzu. What a champ. Yeah, you have to find the ch where the chocobo feathers are laying on the ground. That's what it is. It probably just has piercing and heat touch, if I had to guess. Fire strike, not heat touch. What the hell is that? Heat touch is from something else, I think. Hey! Thank you so much for your words yesterday. Shalinda. Safe journey to you. Thank you, sir. Thank you. Thank you. So are there more chocobo jumps? Oh my ass. Ugh. Oog. Kick it open for me, chocobo. Yeah! So I guess I can leave the high road here. Oh, I can just travel down the path that I was on. Yeah, 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 yeah. Because I guess you had to get up out of it at some, in some way. Um, uh, chocobo jump, boo. Right? Cha. Right? Yeah. Here it goes! Bro, these birds are... These are some of the best birds to ever exist. God. Oh, man. So much stuff. Another scout? I've got like four of them bitches. Now we're down here. Hey. Hey, girl. What are you doing on this road? Oh, you know. Look around. The high road ends over there. However, we have sealed off the area beyond for the duration of our operation here. You may ask the gate captain up ahead if you need to pass through. Nice. Let's see, are there any other... Oh, there's a walker. What are you doing here, bro? You can't run a business with no... Say. Walker, why are you so stupid? <laughs> oh, I hear you a dummy. Let's let's pump up some potions. Pump up the potions while your feet are oh, stomping. Let's get some more of these bitches. Uh, and I'm good on those. Okay. Wait, you know the voice Lucille also voices Shantoto. She does Shantoto. You think? That's awesome. Because I love Shantoto. She's great. For both Final Fantasy XI and Final Fantasy XIV, my primary, my primary like race that I played as is always the short folk. Like the Lalafell in fourteen. I I love the shit out of those little guys. I love those little potatoes. Especially um Oh, there's the Mars Crest. That's to upgrade. Orin's ultimate weapon, I think. Um, because I need the Mars Crest and the Mars... Lens, I think? I don't remember. Um... Candy Milo. Yeah. 
is a potato man. <laughs> They're just cute, all right? They're oh, oh, here we go. I knew there was another jump. Let's go. They're just cute, man. Okay. And my first character that I made was a was a um, was a little potato man. He's the one I still play the most. He's my level fifty something black mage. The upgrade to Ronso better be permanent. I mean, you know, if I ever feel like playing Black Mage again, because I like the Black Mage rotation, it's fun. But I'm I'm enjoying playing the Ronso guy. He's he's just hot. He's great. I'm thinking about what kind of personality he has. I kind of think like the, the the Final Fantasy 14 characters get to the OC level of like them having a personality in my head, and you know, thinking about scenarios and stuff like that because. You know, sometimes the character brain rot is is there. How many times do I have to tell you? I'm it's fine though. It's fine. Sorry, ma'am. No exceptions. You dare impede a summoner's pilgrimage? Sorry, ma'am. No exceptions. Except for us, because we're special. <laughs> well, let me save before I talk to them, because. I don't care about them. Oh, it's you. As you can see, not even summoners can pass. Huh, <laughs> bet. Watch this. Just wait and see. In the meantime, I think I'll have a nap. Oh, Bartello. They're gonna go have a nap. The Mushroom Rock Road is off limits to non I was given express permission that I could go. So how about you fuck hey, off? Captain Lucille and Elma should have. They're down in the gorge, bro. You have to leave your chocobos here. Come on, everyone off. <sighs> fine. Fine, 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 fine. Scotta and Luzu reporting, sir. This is the last of them. Good to have you with us. Go on through. We're sneaking in. It's got a little mouth. It says. Wait around. We'll have sin beaten in no time. Ah, these foolish men and their foolish foolishness, I guess. <laughs> foolish. We go in. I'm sorry, I can't let you pass. I was given permission. You're a summoner and her guardians, right? Sorry for the inconvenience. What? They didn't tell you? I want to know. We're tell me. Sin spawn from all over Spira here. Sin spawn inevitably draws sin, right? We're going to lure it into a trap. Wait, does the one guy have an ass crack window on his outfit? Wait, which one guy? Which guy? Uh, the, the, the small guy? Or the older guy? Or this guy? This mission, Operation Meehan, is a crusader albed. We crusaders lure Sin in, and the albed strike it down. Is everyone's outfit in this game? It's, it's future fashion. It's future fashion a la the early 2000s. I think it's peak. I'm sorry, I can't let you pass. Yes, you can. Eat shit. Any donation toward Operation Um Well Operation Meehan's gonna fail, so I'm not gonna waste my money. <laughs> so Oopsie. Oh. Oh yeah. I kinda forgot he was just gonna show up. Mr. Say More. So we meet again, Lady Yuna. I yes. You look troubled. Is there anything I can do? Oh, it was a guy that got into the caravan. No. Ah, gotcha. I see. Mr. Seymour, 
Let me show you to the command center. Hold. I have a request. Yes, Your Grace. I need to have Summoner Yuna and her guardians let through to the command center. But... but Maester Seymour... Maester Seymour, sir. Do not worry. I will take full responsibility. I kind of miss how jank he looked in the PS2 version. Because, <laughs> like... It's, it's like how Selkie had said before. They did kind of yassify everyone important in this game. But, like, his, uh, his, uh, Thank you, your grace. face looked so funny. It used to look so hilarious. Is this the baddie? <laughs> like, <laughs> you're not supposed to know that he's the baddie. But from the moment we see him, like, two hours-ish, Prior to this in the game, you just know that he's like, you know, what a well mannered and non threatening character. Oh boy. Oh boy. I sure do love that, Mr. Seymour. <laughs> I'm so sorry about that. Just forget that that happened. <laughs> oh boy. Seymour. Oh man. What a totally non threatening sounding character theme. Brave crusaders of Spira, protectors of I don't want to do that again, Selkie. In the path you have chosen. This is like JoJo characters trying to pass as civilians. I mean, I feel like the characters they do stand out a little more than your your background NPCs like these. But like it all kind of fits in. You know what I mean? Does Seymour get together with Mickey and Kingdom Hearts or something? Yeah, yeah, that happens. Yeah, they fuck. Mickey, Mickey fucks him in the asshole because Mickey is definitely the top in that relationship. They're willing to risk it for the greater good. Waka, I think Maester Seymour sees that too. Lulu. Hmm. I can only speculate. Ask him yourself. She's so tiny. Ah, Sir Oran, it is an honor. I would be most interested. Mickey has the key you for your hole, Seymour. You better watch out. I've got nothing to say about it. He's gonna unlock you. <laughs> Sir Oran must be a great asset. Oh boy. Guardian. Your Grace. Please, there's no need for formalities. Excuse me. Maester Seymour, why is your lord? Just ignore him. Just ignore that guy. Present here, sir. Please speak as you normally would. Uh, <laughs> he says, "Please don't try to use high language. I know you are from beneath me, so just speak. <laughs> don't strain yourself. Don't bust a blood vessel, young man." Truly wish peace for Spira. This Operation Meehan was born from that wish they share. Although it may be sacrilege to Yevon, their intentions are pure. And I, Seymour Guado, the person, not the maester of Yevon, as a denizen of Spira, I wish them well in their endeavor. But using Machina, that's bad, isn't it? Pretend you didn't see them. <laughs> Hell yeah. Beg your pardon, but that's not something a maester should say. Then pretend I didn't say it. You're kidding. Okay, yeah, he's kind of based though. <laughs> From the first time I laid eyes on him, I never did like Seymour. Like, but you know, it's it's nice when he starts out a little bit based, day, but then he just becomes a simp and an incel, and it's just kind of really annoying. Just like real religion, precisely. Yeah, he knows how to deliver them lines for sure. Um, for this area, do I have anything with Stone Ward? Because we got some, we got some, I think, cockatrices on this road that are going to get me bricked up but not in 
not in a way that is going to be preferable to anybody. <laughs> I mean, he does try to arrange a marriage with Yuna. He does try to do that. And yes, we can fault him for it. He's the worst kind of simp, and we don't like it. At the... Let me... I mean, it's got the fucking bombs. I really just do not feel like dealing with them. We're gonna just leave. Live and let live. Hold up, I think we'd like that. Oh, they collided. Excuse me, Lady Summoner Yuna? Yes. The command oh, that's what's so uncanny about the portraits. They look Mr. like that Seymour face app smile filter. <laughs> that's awesome. That's hilarious. Take that road to the command center. It's not far. I do recall this way. the boss the boss of this area. Uh, when I was young it used to give me trouble. Um, good time. <laughs> Sneak past the guards, I did. Good for you, brother. Ice brand. Let's see. Da -da. Metal shield. Rod of wisdom. Mine's better. Uh, Null frost. Magic bangle. Light bracer. That doesn't help me at all. None of these help me, bro. Yeah, I'd say you do owes me one. I'd say you do owes me one. Oh, God. Uh, but the AP. But the AP. As you wish. Let's just take you out first. Not to deal with your ass. We're gonna dart attach. Wink. He's gonna get a big hit. Misu. Yes. Yeah, I need to build up some fucking limits before the boss fight, because god damn what a terrible boss fight. I don't know if I'm going to get to that boss fight tonight, actually, now that I... Now that I look at what time it is. It's getting a little on the later side. But... I'm also not really tired at all. I've been staying up too late, and... Kind of fucked up me, me sleeping schedule. Just, just, just a wee. Just, just a wee. In that, I just... am not really all that tired. Let's delay you. Just die, bro. So, Dark Attack's worn off on you and has already worn off on you for sure. Oh my god. How it hit, though? Dark You got darkness. He's deep in the darkest darkness. Thank you. Crime. So get this is a section before you reach the operation zone. Yeah, it's it's not very I know it's not a long section, but it's enough of one to just kind of be like annoying. Let me get some ability spheres off this chump. Hit him. Yeah! 610. That's fine. Uh, bonk. And then. Let's let Kamari get some. <laughs> get him. Yeah! That smell. I can smell you! Ugh, <laughs> uh, bruh. Point, right? Yeah, let's go. Yeah, 
Yeah, we should actually... We might get to the boss fight. It's, it's right at the end of this area, which is not very big at all. Increase the field activity. Oh, thank you! <laughs> I'm me. <laughs> he, he do be saying, I'm him. I'm him. I love that expression. It's so funny. It's going, I'm him. <laughs> okay. We don't really want to. No, water is the opposite of thunder. Blizzard is the opposite of fire. I keep getting... Because, like, when I think water, I'm like, oh, wait. I'm like, fire, kill, right? Should. Just based solely on merit. Oh, wait, I th can I get a, an ability from this mushroom guy? No, I thought I could. I was incorrect. He does have, like, some bullshit move, though, I think. He casts fire, so that kind of sucks. Um. All right, cool rank. I need now. you to get this lizard. He keeps sticking his tongue out, maybe uncomfortable. Etho. Selkie, when you put that in my when you put that in the chat, it made my whole chat box glitch out. All right, hang on. I gotta see what you're weak to, because I can't actually tell. Oh, it's weak to fire, but it casts fire. That's weird. I guess that makes sense, because it's a mushroom. I just just hadn't occurred to me, because I'm, I'm what they call foolish, so don't even worry about it. Mmm, mmm, delicious AP, mmm. Silky with the dark YouTube code. No kidding. Gonna crash my whole fucking shit, dude. Okay. God, I hate this controller so much. Watch and weep, Crusaders. <laughs> he says, fuck y'all and y'all plans. You suck. Hey, you fucking suck, dude. And it's going to be loose time, so we want to extract ability on you. The price to pay for the bit? You mean the price that you're making me pay for the bit? <laughs> Your antics crash my system. How could you do this to me? Kimari in here. Get him to get a lancet off. Heal up a little bit. And then Lulu coming for the kill. Alright. Okay, okay, okay. Money! A summoner's entourage. Please accept this. Ten potions? Man! Let's go. The game said, hey, you're probably going to want these chief. Like, oh boy, <laughs> that's exciting. Get Orin. Been hurt. Kill him. Is there like a bestiary in this game? Like, I know there isn't, like, one, like, a book that you get that you can sift through. Can you, at the months, at the arena, in the, in the, the calm lands, is there, like, a, a bestiary that you can, like, look through there? Um, it seems like kind of a missed thing that they could have had for this game. At least, at least in the, ver like, the remaster, the re-release. Putting a bestiary in, because... I like that shit. I like when I can go through and look at all the monsters. I think it's pretty cool. No, I need skill. Stop going to special. 
No, it's in Ten Two. Okay. I mean, you know, I don't, I don't recall the enemies being too different in Ten Two. Like they're gonna have some new ones for sure, but it's mostly the same stuff. You see the monsters if you capture them, but don't know if it says anything about them. Okay, not quite one like that. I just think those are neat. Damn, how's Cool Rank even alive? That's pretty good. Get some heals up. Finish the fight. Okay. Now we hit. Oh, we almost hit in ten thousand gil. We sitting pretty damn pretty. We've been expecting you. Please proceed to the command center. Okay, Lucio. All right. Selkie, so, you looked up the lady's name who does her, and you, you're, you're writing that she does Shantota. Who else does she do? She sounds like she would be a voice actor of the time, TM. In so much that, like, she would have had a bunch of roles. Stop going to special, you dumb idiot. I swear to God. I'm going to go crazy. How did not kill it? Ugh. Fucking A. Okay, we got an overdrive for you now, which is pretty cool. She needs to also not die. I'd like that. Punch it. Yeah. Um... And then we go Braco Magic. Fire. There's a lot of stuff in there in this area. Yeah, like she's like I like I, how I said she seems like one of the voice actors of the time TM. Oh, we're all asleep now. That bites. It didn't wake her up. What the hell is that? Okay. Um, you need it. Everyone else is fine. The presence of a maester and a summoner is great for the troops' morale, myself included. Thank you for being here, my lady. You didn't even want us to come. You're like, oh, you can't pass. What is she doing here? She's not authorized personnel. I wasn't able to stop them, as you can see. But seeing their fierce determination, I couldn't just sit there. So I decided that I would do everything in my power to help them. Good on you, Shalinda. What's showing up? Oh, big bird. We got that big bird. It's it is in fact the biggest bird. It is the biggest bird. It is the biggest bird. It is the biggest bird. Bring it on. Uh I don't need to waste the magic. Let's just go ahead and swing at it. I foresee no difficulty. Give it a swing. Give it a couple swings. Boink. Not the bed. Oh, good night, Chapo. Thanks for coming in and hanging out. It was a good time. Have a good sleep. Just die already.
Yo. How you still got that much? I guess it does have like 4k. That's just annoying. <laughs> Ugh. Well, I can't get a delay on it again. It's not gonna do much. Just picking on Waka. You know what? Fuck it. Yeah, daylight savings pretty whack for sure. She gets to have a chocobo, but then again, hers is armored and, you know, battle trained. I was, I was riding a casual chocobo, but he could do sick tricks and jumps and shit. Recording echo all weekend with Chapo. Mm-hmm. That, that'll do it. Recording, recording do do that. You're gonna focus him and kill him. Oh, what? Color me. Supris. Um... Leo slander memes. They're they're funny. They are funny as shit. All right, we're getting some. We're gonna be getting some overdrives full. I think. Let's go. Just in time for the fucking fight. Um, you should be about dead. No, that healed it. I'm, I'm so fucking stupid. He has a fire weapon. You dumb son of a bitch. Oh, my brain, dude. Oh no, I'm stupid. Oh no, I'm stupid. Even are these floating chicken wings? There are the elements. Like there's ones for fire and thunder and water and ice. Hypodoin. Nice. What more do you have to say? Does Lucille make it out this battle? I don't remember. That might be why she lets us talk to her so much during this this time. Cause like, so we can like get attached or some shit. Uh, mm, I think I don't want to deal with this guy. Live and let live. How about we just go? How about we just leave? I think that's the better the better choice. Feel cool rank a real bit. Whoa, video game. Hey. Lady Summoner, what are you doing here? What's up, Alma? Don't you push me out the way, what the fuck? We go up. Go up. We are almost there. Give this to the Lady Summoner and grant us your help when the time comes. An X potion. Or is it cross? Or is it. Is it a key? Some pronounce it Kai potion. Is that, is that what it is? Key, some say Kai potion. Oh. <laughs> uh, but a 
That's funny, Selkie. <laughs> Yo, guys, wake up, please. <laughs> Man, we almost got so many fucking overdrives. Look at us, <laughs> except for Kimari's. Uh, five and 89. Oh, check this out. Wait, 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 I can, I can, I can make this work for me. Get him, you Get him! Get him! Get that kill! Need the Sailor Moon choking image. <laughs> oh boy. Get him, Cool Rank. Explore down here later before we go into the operation. I just want to get to the save point because I think I'm, I think I'm going to pack it up here once I get to the save, which is up there. Because we're going to do the boss fight next time, but I want to get to the save point first. Do a little more exploring some other time. I also just need to not die. Raw. That guy's tongue is so whack, dude. What up, dudes? We've secured the command center perimeter, but please take this as a precaution. Mega protein. Oh, there he is. There he goes. All right, we save in. Does saving? Does saving heal the party? It should. I think it does. Heals your party. Heals your aeons. That sounds correct. And I'd be right. Let's go. Yeah, that's kind of what I'm thinking too, is this is a good enough place to grind before the boss fight. So I think for now, I'm going to call it, I'm going to probably do a little more exploring in this area, pick up any chests I might have missed, grind, get a, get the fill in that sphere grid a little more and get ready for the upcoming boss fight because I don't like this boss fight. I'm not, I'm not a huge fan. It's cool. I like the sin spawn that we fight. I just don't remember it going very well for me when I was younger. So, we'll see how it goes. But uh, thank you guys for coming in and chilling. It was a good time. Um, making a bit of progress. It's pretty good. We're at, what are we at? Eight, eight and a half hours. That's pretty good. That's, that's pretty good. Um, but uh, until next time, fellas. Thanks for stopping in. And uh, I'll, I'll, I'll try to give you forewarning before I move forward. But, you know. We'll see how it goes. You guys have a great night, and I will see you later. Oh no, the authorization. <laughs>